and uh, DRDO also is bringing in a lot of changes also in mm -hmm. their setup, mm -hmm. their way of testing okay. and all that there is tremendous changes. Okay. It is no longer you know of the 1960s, now we are into the uh, electronic age okay. and uh, RCI if you see, the RCI is in electronics mm -hmm. and they are bringing a lot of you know anti-jamming and uh, anti-radiation missiles also. Mm -hmm. That is a real boost like Rudram and uh, others, you know, Shakti, okay. Mission Shakti. These are all, you know, you can, uh, that uh, some 125 square kilometers, mm -hmm. you can jam the signals. Okay. Completely signals will not work and uh, you can wage a war. It is an electronic warfare. Mm -hmm. These are all, you know, people now, they are learning all how to do it okay. practically. Earlier there was no practicality, but now the facilities, you know, incorporates you to do such, such things. Like, you know, ISRO also, mm -hmm. that orbiting, a, a new, we devised a new method of orbiting and uh, land on the moon mm -hmm. without uh, extra fuel. Yes. Uh, that type of concepts are all coming. So all the latest technologies? Latest technologies. These are all the latest technologies and it comes only by practice. That means you are more focused in that area, okay. specialization. Like, you know, for me, chemistry is uh, everything. Okay. So anything I talk about chemistry from my side. Similarly, electronics fellow will be looking at the electronics, how can minimize that. Mm -hmm. So now the INS is such a big size. Mm -hmm. Now I have brought it to such a small size. Mm -hmm. So I can put two INSs. Okay. Navigational systems. So, you know, it gives a more clarity. Mm -hmm. The kill ratio, that means, uh, you know, the target mm -hmm. is fixed at this point. Mm -hmm. I can, you know, pinpoint accuracy. Mm -hmm. See, in the same place, within seconds I should hit. Okay. And the damage should be uh, square kilometer of area, how much it will damage is cost. Mm -hmm. How much, uh, uh, you know, the radiations will be felt, how much of energy will be dispersing, all that can be calculated nowadays. Okay. That type of facilities we are, we are also having. Now the so, all these calculations you have it in the missile? No, no, it is not in the missile. The amount of warhead what I give, suppose mm. I have uh, fixed with some 10 kgs of TNT, mm. generally the next lights also will have TNT, I am okay. just telling you. Huh. 10 kg of TNT, you'll say the damage is caused mm. killing only one person. Mm. But uh, ours is not that way. Mm. 10 kg, how much area it will damage and how many people will die. Okay. That we will have to calculate. Okay. So that calculation, you know, it is kept secret and uh, that will be fed. Mm -hmm. And uh, when we are putting that type of ammunition, mm. we know that this will be the amount of damage it will take place. So as a safety also, you know, mm -hmm. it is a safety calculation. Once you give those data to the team, mm -hmm. they'll say, suppose you are manufacturing a missile. Mm -hmm. Then they'll say, in a crowded area, you should not have more than one missile. Okay. Mm -hmm. That type of restrictions will come. Mm -hmm. That is a, as a safety point of view to help the mankind because Hyderabad is surrounded by a lot of cities. Mm -hmm. Now again, a lot of people are there. Mm. So, there is a restriction on the integration of the missile. So, all these missiles, if you are doing on ammunition basis and all, no, mm. it will be restricted and it will be transferred to some other location where there is no mankind. Mm. So, in that place, it will be integrated again. It is all like that. So, that precautions we are taking. Thank you so much for sharing the inf information regarding DRDO and BrahMos. It was very nice to talk to you. Thank you. Thank you so much for the science up and uh, this should be the foundation for learning. Why I am saying is, you know, arms race is something, you know, to make the country proud. We have to work really hard in these fields. We are very good in peacemaking, but we are not uh, very hard cutthroat in uh, cutting edge technologies. So, this missile technologies will prove to the world that we are a superpower. All the best for the new science up.